Hey, JB here with another video for you. I am in the brick kiln once again, and uh, just got finished picking four orders that I got. Nothing super special tonight. And I'm gonna pack those up here in a minute, but I think I'm going to part out some Star Wars sets. Or maybe some Ninjago sets, because they're tiny. I decided on these 501st battle packs. I have four of them. And I want to get those clones in my store. When I was here last night, I went ahead and numbered all of the drawers in this section. The new section here. Let's zoom out there. And um, my next set of drawers, I ordered more, should be in tomorrow to finish off at least... Part of this. I think I just got enough to do one section here and a section on the end or a section on the back side here. I, th I think probably what I'll end up doing is coming to the back first and then if I add more I'll just slide the one set around to the end and then keep going back that way. Also I rearranged things a little bit to try and make it make a little more sense um, still not sure I'm completely satisfied with it, but I'm, I'm doing what I can with what I got for now. <laughs> I fully expect to get an order from Republic Bricks after this. Looking for parts for his custom sets. And all these boxes, I was not careful with them. And the instructions are pretty crumpled as it is. So all this is going to go in the recycling. The recycling pile has gotten... A little ridiculous. Um, I haven't actually taken the recycling since I moved into the space. Oh, and I still need to get rid of this thing. I don't know if I mentioned it in a video or not, but I picked this up from a job I was on because they were going to throw it away, and I brought it home, and it doesn't work. So uh, it's a it was a wine cooler. I was going to use it for Mountain Dew, <laughs> but uh, yeah, it doesn't work. So it needs to go to the scrapyard, and I keep forgetting to load it up when I have my work van. I was going to print my labels off and get those orders ready to go, but uh, my d computer decided it wanted to be slow until I updated, and now it wants to be slow while updating, so um, <laughs> I guess uh, I'll have to wait until it's done, so that's why I'm going to go part those sets out now. And just like that, the set is parted out. I've got all the cups stacked just because it was easier to do it that way. And uh, I didn't have to worry about filling up my space. And my computer's still not done. So we'll see if that finishes before I have to leave tonight. Okay, so most of the parts are put away for that 501st set. Um, I'm going to do something a little different with these arms than what I had originally planned on. When I was uploading the parts, I realized that the battle droid, the way it comes in the set, is worth $1.92. But, if you take and use two straight arms, the average sold price is $3.09. So if you just switch up the arms that they give you, including the extras, you have enough for, I think, was it six, six of the two straight arms and two of both with the curved arms. But then I was looking, and if you do it with two of the curved arms, and let's see if I can remember what drawer number that was, it was five. Oh, shouldn't be that hard to see, right? Well, somewhere over here. Oh yeah, right here. If you take this four cent piece and put it on the back of those battle droids, becomes a battle droid tan with a backplate, which makes it worth four dollars and nine cents. So uh, I'm gonna take and get a couple more of these. I'm, I th think I'm gonna do six or three and three maybe. Three and three of the, uh, or four and four, because there should be enough for eight. So um, yeah, I'm gonna do four with the back plate and four with two straight arms and upload them that way. There we go. There were 
eight battle droids that were originally going to be under two dollars a piece so that's sixteen dollars roughly a little less than sixteen dollars now these four are worth more than sixteen dollars and these four are worth another twelve dollars so real easy way to make those worth more so we'll see if they and sell this is the carnage from drawers that are over full from the set um since my computer still wasn't finished uploading i did something a little crazy and uploaded through bricklink for the first time in probably close to a year now since i got brick store and uh yeah so my computer is finally finished update updating over there but uh i am done fighting with it for tonight i am gonna go to bed so uh yeah that's gonna wrap up this video thanks for watching till next time y'all have a good one